show you the real meaning of, of Halloween. So let's get started. Okay, so the first reason I don't celebrate Halloween is Halloween does not celebrate God. But what I'm trying to say is trick or treat, who tricks? The Satan tricks. Who treats? Not God. Trick God never tricks anyone. Even though they still celebrate Halloween. God loves you. Even though you sin, even though you do anything bad, he still loves you because he made you with his own hands and his own creation. So that's why the Christians don't get to celebrate Halloween. Reason number two. I'm gonna tell you the whole beginning of the story of Genesis. Okay. So Satan was a beautiful, amazing angel like the other ones. But one day, he got tired. He got tired of following God's rules. He said, I want my own kingdom or domain, which domain is a kingdom. And he tricked the other angels into believing that they got tired of God too. So then they fell into temptation. And I'm going to tell you guys Adam and Eve, the story of Adam and Eve, if you guys don't know it. Adam and Eve, Adam was a man, Eve was a woman. Satan was a snake. So, Satan was in a tree. He was a snake. God told Adam and Eve not to eat from just one tree. They could eat from all the other trees, but one. That was the apple of sin. So then, the, sin, the sa Satan told Eve, Eve didn't, didn't talk, but Eve just ate the apple, and then she told Adam to eat the apple, so then Adam also ate the apple, and after that, that happened, after that, to Adam and Eve said it's told you to eat not eat one tree one tree you guys couldn't follow that it was just one tree I let you eat I let you eat from all the other trees but you ate from the one I said you shouldn't after that they couldn't enter the garden anymore because they were in the garden so they couldn't enter the garden. God had a angel trapped the garden so they couldn't get in. So they had to walk somewhere else because they couldn't live in the garden anymore. He thought, since God had his own celebrations, like Christmas is God's birthday. That's when he was born. But Satan just said, God has his own celebrations. Why should I have a, my own celebration too? Guess what? That's how he made Halloween. He made a celebration on October 31st. That is the day of Halloween. So, Reason number three, Satan is trying to catch your attention. You want to know why? Because the candy. Every time you celebrate Halloween, all you're doing is you're opening your heart and soul to Satan. Do, do you think that's going to make you closer to God? No. 
It's not gonna make you closer to God. It's gonna make you closer to Satan. So, you guys should really think about it. You should really think about it. I'm just showing you this video. So you won't have to be with Satan. You guys could live with God. Even though we can't see God, we can feel Him. We can speak His language. So, let's just try to get closer to God. I'm not saying, I I don't want you guys to think she's just bossing me around. Why should I listen to her? But you guys all have something good in you. I know it. I know you still have something good. You just need to show everyone that you're good. God made you perfect. Maybe you guys think, maybe I'm not perfect. I just don't want you guys to fall into temptation. Temptation is the worst thing. You need to run away from temptation, not go to temptation. You need to walk away from Satan. You need to go closer to God. If you guys ever want to go closer to God, all you have to do is ask God for forgiveness. You need to ask God for forgiveness. God, please. I'm not trying to tell you guys. I'm not trying to boss you. I just want you guys to be with God. Open up your hearts to God. God doesn't control you. God lets you do whatever you want. But you need to follow the Ten Commandments. Honor your father and mother. And you will live a long life. Don't steal. If not, you're not going to live a long life. There's still more. You. There's a lot of commandments, and if you guys ever want to know commandments, all you have to do is go get a Bible that says Holy Bible or Santa Biblia. Santa Biblia is the Bible for Spanish. You can learn Spanish there, Santa Biblia, or you can watch Holy Bible, which is English. And there are some books for kids to read, like Noah's Ark. There's a lot of books that are Christian. So this is like, this shows God and kids praying and said, that means it's Christian. So Noah's Ark is Christian. Noah's Ark is Christian. And in the Bible, there are a lot of testaments. You can know the beginning, you know Adam and Eve. You know the New Testament, you know the Old Testament, and I think the Bible tells you the Ten Commandments. And if you ever want to hear Christian music, all you have to do is go to K Love or Air One. I think Air One is 94.3. On your car, you could watch 94.3, or K Love could be 97.3. 97.9 or 94.3. Those two are Christian songs. They always play my favorite. You can go to check out my playlist because my playlist has a lot of my favorite songs. I still have a bunch more, but I just did my top five, I think. Top five. And I want you guys to go to heaven. Hell is where Satan lives, heaven is where God lives. You guys should really think about it. I want you guys to go to heaven. Hell is where Satan lives. Heaven is where God lives. You guys should really think about it. Which God doesn't trick. God has a lot of names. Lord, Savior, Father. If you guys say, why is God Father? He made us. Maybe you guys might have a stepdad, a stepfather, you call whatever. You have a, a father in heaven. He always watches over you. Everything you do. When you do bad, just Satan comes into your heart. Controls you, makes you mad. Makes you want to scream at your parents for doing nothing. It's correct to apologize to God. It's correct 
so apologize to your parents. If you want to hear a lot of songs, go to K Love, which is 97.9, or Air One, 94.3. Those two always have Christian music every day. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope you guys tell other people about this. Maybe you could give, you could share this video. This video is very shareable. Okay, I'm. I'm okay with you guys sharing this video. It's good for you. Okay, so it's good for you. And guess what? Maybe if you guys are not doing, celebrating Halloween because you know the real truth, it's, I'm gonna be happy for you. I'm gonna be happy for you if you guys celebrate Halloween and now you saw this video and you said, mm, she is right about all the Halloween. We shouldn't celebrate it anymore. Well, that's good. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And today's shout out goes to Faith Garcia. Thank you, Faith Garcia. So, thank you, Faith Garcia, for commenting down in my video. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit the bell bell and so you can know every time I post a new video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye. <laughs>